Third guy we're going to look at, quarterback Tyler Huntley. Created uh, some conspiracy theories when they signed him because you got Winston, you got DTR, you obviously have Watson, and now you have Tyler Huntley. But this guy can play. We've, we've seen him enough play for the Ravens um, when Lamar has been hurt. He's a pretty good quarterback. So my first breakdown of this guy, so I started breaking this guy down, and, and I think he fits the skill set even better than Jameis Winston. Now, the one thing he does not do extremely well, he's not super, he doesn't have great arm talent. But he does, uh, he does understand defense very well. So first thing you're going to get here is his ability to read. This is what he does very good. He understands coverage and he finds the open guy. Next you're going to see is that he's very good with his feet. So this is a quarterback draw. So you can do the plus run game. Uh, that was a draw on fourth down. Next thing he does is he extends plays very well. Very much like Watson, then he's going get, to get a first down here. And if you're talking about a guy who's a backup or a guy coming in, um, the one thing he needs to do a little bit better is protect the football. He's got four turnovers uh, last year. But besides that, he's a guy who's a gamer. Uh, when I think of Huntley, I think of a guy that's you know, got 1,800, you know, 1,900 career yards passing. Uh, he's got great feet. Uh, his in intermediate throws are the best. He processes information. Uh, he'll stand in the pocket. He's real tough. Uh, he seems like a great team guy. He's very, um, he's very easy, right? He's very non-needy. Uh, as a coach, I always like guys who are very non-needy. They come every day. Uh, you know where they're going to be. Uh, they don't say much. They're not very controversial. This is what it seems like Huntley is. He's a guy who just seems like he's a football player first. Uh, everything else comes second. And we've seen it against the Browns. He's a gamer. So he can make those throws when necessary. I don't think he's a guy you can win because of, but I do think he's a guy you can win, win with. And, and another guy that gives you great, great flexibility um, with Watson. You don't have to do much different with this guy in the game. He just can't stretch it vertically as well. But really good, really good quarterback and tough, and I really like, really like his film. Now, the other thing I would say, they signed him for the, the um, veteran minimum. So don't be too surprised if Andrew Barry flips one of those three backup quarterbacks for a draft pick a la Josh Dobbs a season ago. So that's just something to keep an eye on as you get closer to the regular season and, and uh, quarterbacks become – you know, they're a currency because everybody needs a quarterback, it seems like, in the NFL. 